Hey guys, welcome back to DeFi, DGEN's Drip and Farm for Poverty. Where on this channel, our vision is to empower the impoverished by helping you find financial freedom through crypto assets. Please subscribe and leave a comment and a thumbs up. Hey guys, welcome back. DeFi, DJ's Drip and Farm for Poverty. So today is a little bit different uh, video for me. It's actually a response to some comments um, that I had and I want to um, explain or help you guys understand it from the perspective of a YouTuber. So I made this video here, warning, do not invest in these Forex Shark projects, must watch first, right? And um, comments were actually split. I got like a 50-50. But um, there was a few of you in here that I already addressed, but I want to explain it so you actually understand how it works. Um, Gracie Jiu Jitsu, the clickbait title doesn't help us, brother. Yes, yes, some of your contents may be great, but this title is very shady. Do change the title if you're actually bullish, it doesn't help the cause. Um, so actually, I want to help you guys understand that this actually does help the cause. If you were making YouTube content and you were understanding how the algorithm works, you would know this, but a lot of you don't. So I want to hopefully shed some light on that. In this video here, I went into a deep dive on how the adoption curve works and how the YouTube algorithm works and how more eyes on drip and how we'll actually gain market adoption and more people buy it, yada, 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 right? But you can watch this video. I'll try to remember to pin a card up somewhere on this video while I'm talking about it. But specifically, let's go to vidIQ and look at uh, the search volume. So drip has the most search volume by far. And I can look at my analytics. So I'm talking a lot about drip, but let's see how the video fared. Because you said the comments were this doesn't help drip. Well, in my views, my top, it's in already in my top six, and this just got released. 1600 views. My highest is 2100 because I use Pulse Chain in the title, and Pulse Chain has a lot of people. Then this one, another quote unquote negative video, the real reason drip is down. Uh, this one has 2,100 views. So what you guys don't understand is that there are people on the sidelines looking to get in drip and they're um, looking from this actual sales funnel um, awareness um, that I'm gonna pull up and show you. So they're sitting at the top. They're not like you guys that already know about drip and just wanna be bullish on drip and how it works. They're actually in this awareness phase. This is a sales funnel. They may be in this awareness or opinion, right? And in order for them to move down to purchase, this is the traditional sales funnel um, that everybody uses in, in products and markets. This is nothing specific to crypto, but at the end of the day, you want people to buy drip. Well, if they are just now hearing about drip due to this insanely high search volume, they're like, okay, what is drip? Who is Forex? They're trying to get some information. Once they get information, they're aware, they're trying to formulate an opinion. So why do you think on my videos, these quote unquote negative clickbait title videos are some of the most best performing. <laughs> it's because there are people looking for this content. And since I'm actually not fudding drip and not putting in negative information, and I'm actually trying to help these people get into it, um, once they watch it, they realize that, but it helps them click on it because they're looking for a reason to support them not getting into it, for the example. Like when you're in an opinion stage, when you're here in the sales funnel, this is where you are trying to uh, formulate pros and cons. Like if you're looking to buy a car, this is where you're looking at different cars and has better gas mileage and you know better safety features. Asking friends, hey, what do you think about this car? Do you, are, do you like it? Uh, no, man, uh, it flipped over three times on me by itself. You know, whatever. This is where the opinions come in and that's what they're looking for. So people are actually, and I have the data, so like you guys can be all upset all you want, but let your data drive your decisions, not your emotions. So when you look at the data, it shows that these videos are some of the better performing videos. Even this one's kind of negative, why most won't be whales, uh, because it's telling you why you won't make it. Um, and then this one, this literally came out less than a couple days ago and it's already in my top top six. And this these other videos have been out a lot longer. So this one's it's top number one and it's run for three times as long. So I get that you guys may not agree with the clickbait title, but Again, let your data drive your decisions. And based on the fact that people are searching for drip, based on the fact that I know that they are in this phase here because it's getting more and more awareness and um, they're trying to move through this and make a decision. They wanna to get to an intent, either to get in or to get out. And by having people like me who use, yeah, clickbait, 
Um, but it's legitimate. Like, there's actually a lot of people that uh, agreed. Like, this person, perfect reasons, not clickbait, the truth, um, totally acceptable clickbait, uh, precise time, I something different. Uh, percept, the title gives a perspective that most people do not cover that are in these protocols already. It's all about mindset. So some people understand it, some don't. I get you uh, drip maxis that sit on the sidelines. You may not get it, but if you start making content, you realize that you have to, as my mentor says, operate the way the world is, not how you wish it was. And unfortunately, YouTube uh, rewards things like this and puts it in front of people based off of these um, titles. And this does help drip. So here's uh, another video from Sprout. They're really good at giving you details on how to optimize for SEO and things of that nature. This is how your videos show up in search uh, results. Relevancy, how well do your keywords relate to what matches in a title description and video content? That's exactly what I did. Engagement, videos that have had the most engagement as related to search query. Well, I already showed you. I have higher than average engagement and views on this video compared to other videos. And uh, watch time, videos that have driven the most watch time as they relate to search query. So when people click on this clickbait and they are already in the top uh, of my percentile of watch time, um, that is helping the algorithm put this out to more people. <laughs> so again, the data is there, guys. Uh, you can be upset all you want to, but it works. So um, I will continue to do it and apologize for those of you that don't get it or um, don't understand it or don't want to understand it, but watch this other video that I already mentioned here and you'll understand about the product adoption curve and how markets actually work and uh, um, how we get more eyes on drip and then do some research on sales funnels and then you'll understand that this is where a lot of people sitting on the sidelines are at. You, me, people that are familiar with drip, we're already here. <laughs> we're in the loyalty and advocacy where I'm out promoting drip to people, right? So we've gone through this. And, and we're getting furthermore hardened in this area here because we're in one of the toughest times Drip has seen so far. But there's people sitting on the sidelines that need to move through this funnel and this kind of contact, content helps them to do that. So that is it for this video. Nice and short, kept it under seven minutes. All right, guys, until next time, lift daily and achieve your impossible. See ya.